In this video, I'm going to show you how you can reset your WordPress website inside of Hostinger. This is pretty easy. I'm going to show you the best method to do it. So let's jump into it. So first go to websites once you've logged into Hostinger. You'll then see all of your different websites. I'm going to be resetting today this one here, searchbasemethod.com. So here is the website. It's just a blank WordPress website with a different theme, but I'm just going to show you how you can reset it, right? So you want to go to manage. And then once you're in manage, you want to head over to your admin panel and that will take you into WordPress. And here you'll be able to see your website, see all of the plugins and all of the pages, posts that you've currently got. Now, if you want to save any of this, save it now because when you reset it, it's all going to be gone. So moving back to Hostinger, you want to go to Hostinger, you want to go to your H panel of your domain and of your website. You then want to scroll down, you want to go to File, then go to File Manager. From here, you want to click Access Files of your domain. Now, if you click on access files of all of your web hosting and you've got multiple websites, you're going to delete all of your websites. So only make sure if you want to delete your one website, click access files of and then the website you want to delete. That's going to open up all of these files and you want to click on the public file and then you need to highlight all of this. So click control A and that will highlight all of it. Then go to the bin, click delete and then click delete again. Now, once you've done that, you can then go back and go back again. So now we can close out of this window and now we need to go to databases and go to a management. And then here you'll see all of these different databases. You just want to go ahead and delete. Make sure it says your website here and then go ahead and delete this. Confirm delete. Right now we've done that. We'll go back to hosting. In fact, we'll go back to websites and you can see here is your website. Now, if we just go to this website, it should now not be working. Yep. Now we need to reinstall WordPress. So go to manage. So now you want to go to your H panel on Hostinger. Once you've deleted all of them files and all of those databases. Now you want to scroll down, go to website, go to auto installer. Now we can reinstall WordPress. So now go to WordPress, click select. And here you can enter in a new title. So I'll just type in here knowledge base and I'll type in a quick password here. Then click next, then click install and then that should reinstall WordPress. Make sure you click over right here. And there you go, WordPress should then be installed. So now if we go to our admin panel, should be a brand new WordPress. So we're now inside of our website. If we click on visit site, you can see it's the brand new WordPress theme. So that's how you can reinstall WordPress on Hostinger. So I hope that video helped you out.